now from downtown Cleveland and progressive field we've got a perfect night for baseball on the show it's the New York Yankees taking on the Cleveland Guardians first pitch coming your way next Okay, all set to go. DJ LeMahieu will get things going. And here it comes. In for a strike. And this one is off and running. Comes up empty on the swing. 0 oh, 2 now. Well, you got the hitter already chasing that nasty slider. If you're on the mound, you just want to expand the zone right now. Get a swing and miss and one get ball, through this at bat. Next pitch in the dirt. Ball one. Caught him looking for the K. Oswaldo Cabrera, the next to hit. First pitch, and that's in for a strike. Sharp grounder. That's through for a base hit. Batting third. The right fielder, number nine. One gone runner at first. Aaron. Now at the plate, Judge. Aaron Judge. And he swings and misses, and it's nothing at all. Aaron Judge in 2016 got 95 plate appearances and hit just 179. He kept that number 179 in the notes section on his iPhone the entire offseason, and it gets by him. Back to back singles, timing on the swing was good, able to shoot the ball up the middle. Didn't square it up as much as he probably would have liked, but that's a good approach paying off. Anthony Rizzo steps to the plate. Cabrera on second. Judge at first, one gone. That one hit to right. Brings it in. Two away down. So first and second with two outs. Labor Torres up to hit. Pitch misses inside. And that's ball one. Line to left. No trouble here. Puts it away for the out. And that will end the inning. Welcome back. Here's a big power threat. Andres Jimenez. The second baseman. And a pitch. And there's a strike. Good heater at 98. When Cole's brother-in-law, Brandon Crawford, took him deep, Cole signed a pair of spikes for Brandon Crawford. One that said adios pelota and the other one that said out of here. Yeah, calls by the great John Miller and Dwayne Kuyper of the San Francisco Giants. Twings and misses. It's a strikeout. Pulled the string on the changeup. Stephen Kwan digs in for the Guardians. First offering, and it just misses. There's a strike. The wind and the pitch. They say it went. One ball, two strikes. Ball. Misses, and that's ball two. One down, base is empty. Cuts and misses. It's a strikeout. Got him third. The third now it's hit. Jose Ramirez. One for four with a double in yesterday's game. Pitch misses. And that is ball one. You know, Singy, Jose Ramirez signed that big extension, a five-year, $124 million contract before the 2022 season. But right before that happened, the Guardians came this close to trading him. The 2-1. On. 
There's the strike. Out there on the mound, he's setting the tone early with the fastball. 98 miles per hour up on the scoreboard. The 2-2. Two -two. Got him. Strikes out the side to begin the game. What a start. And welcome back. All set for the start of the inning. Here's Jose Trevino. McKenzie back to work. Out towards right center field. Valera moving under it. And puts the squeeze on that one. And there's one down. He was all over that first pitch fastball. He just barely missed it. Man, this guy was ready to hit. Franchi Cordero, the batter now, as he swings and misses for strike one. That's a strike, and it's nothing in two. The pitch. Hacks and misses. It's a strikeout. And now Bader up to the plate. Good power. Not great in the OBP department. Fouled off. He was late. This lineup's going to have to find a way to make him work a little harder out there on the mound. I mean, he is just mowing him down. He's settling in. You've got to make him uncomfortable. Maybe step. And down on strikes. And good work there as he gets a one, two, three. Here in Cleveland, bottom of the second. And now the switch hitting first baseman, Josh Bell. Fastball in for a strike. Strike one. Swing and a miss. Next offering is fouled back. And a ground ball to first. And he handles it himself for the out. Here's Josh Naylor. Pitch misses there, and it's one and oh. And that's downstairs and outside. Nothing, nothing here in the bottom of the second. And it is two and one. Goodness, I think he just took the best pitch he's going to see in this at bat. You don't get many like that in that location. I don't know if you take that pitch against any pitcher out there on the mound. And he hits a ground ball right side, and it goes just foul. Strike three, got him with the backdoor breaking ball. Oscar Gonzalez digs in for the Guardians. Left field. Cordero makes the play, and it's out number three. Back here in Cleveland. Now it's going to be Anthony Volpe. The shortstop. Anthony Volpe. McKenzie back to work. McKenzie goes six feet five inches. He features a four seam fastball, a slider, and he occasionally uses a curve. And now it's even up. Late that time, and it's strike two. Man, he was really tardy on that fastball. Great job of setting him up by throwing the curveball. Add some velocity to it on the next pitch. Can't catch up. Swings through it, and that's a strikeout. Up to the plate steps DJ LeMayhew. Swings through that one. 0 oh and 1. LeMayhew, a former All Star, hitting leadoff in today's game. And he was a second round pick back in 2009. Puts it in the air out towards left center. Quan settles underneath it. He's there. He's got it. Two up, two down. Oswaldo Cabrera stepping in now for the Yankees. And first offering is fouled off. 
He's done a great job getting the first two outs. Want to get this number two hitter, get back in the dugout, and face three, four, five next inning. Going two now. There he goes down looking. Ready to go for the last half of the inning. So in now for Cleveland, George Valera. First pitch, just misses. And another ball. Here comes a pitch. And that's in for a strike. Well, at that velocity, if that's all you're seeing, 88, you can handle that all day long. That's what you get in batting practice. But off the velocity of the fastball, that is a very tough pitch to adjust to. Two ball, two strikes. Just misses with that one. Next offering is foul back. Righty delivers. Good plate appearance there. Able to take the walk. Well, that's a nice job of grinding out that at bat. Saw a lot of pitches and ends up drawing the walk. Very gritty. Bo Naylor at the plate now. First pitch doesn't find the zone. There's a strike. One ball, one strike. With two strikes. May see some movement over there at first base. Trying to stay out of a double play here. Next pitch is popped up. Drops into the glove. And there's one away. Here's the shortstop at the play. Miles Straw. He's got the power, but great contact skills. One of the best contact hitters in the game. This one in the dirt, and no movement on the bases. It's ball one. The pitch. Runner on the goal. Swing and a miss. No throw. He's in there safely. Strike two. Valera, the runner at second with one away. Not in time, and he reaches safely. Hey, whatever works, right? Doesn't have to be impressive. And now they've got some speed on first, so we'll see if they try to get him into motion. Jimenez in the box now. Takes strike one. He's 0 for 1. And there's a foul ball. The last thing he wants is to hit the ball on the ground, but I wouldn't expect many pitches up in the zone. They'll be pitching for a double one play ball, in this spot. Two strikes. That one misses. It's a ball and two strikes. All two. That's down and in. Little trouble with this one behind the plate. Runners hold tight, but it's a full count now. In the air, left side. He makes the catch, and there's two down. Yeah, that was a wasted RBI opportunity, but competitor like him, he is looking forward to making up for it in his next at bat. Kwan in the box now, takes strike one. Off the mark there. And it's a ball and a strike. Kicks and fires. Ground ball up the middle. That's a base hit. And they strike first as they take a 1-0 lead. Well, he gets it done in a big spot to get the run across. Just a cookie down the middle. I mean, those are the ones you dream about. The ones in the cage you're just hoping you get in the ball game. Right down the middle, not a whole lot of velocity. Right on top of it. And there's a strike. 
I love that Garrett Cole is sort of a throwback guy out there on the mound, sort of that classic power pitcher. He's going to attack with that fastball, move it all around. Safe there, and we've got runners at second and third with two away. Two outs, two in scoring position. And a 2 1 hammered, but foul. Cole, of course, the first overall pick by the Pirates in the 2011 draft out of UCLA and really blossomed as he moved from Pittsburgh to Houston in 2018. Cleveland up around looking for more. Fouled off again, and it remains three and two. He's one of the two pitchers to strike out 14 batters in three consecutive games. Pedro Martinez was the other to do it, but Garrett Cole, again, just a dominant pitcher that wants to finish what he starts. And that's ball four. He knew he had a little wiggle room with the open base, but now that disappears. Mistake to this next batter, and this inning might really break open. Josh Bell at the plate now. And Cleveland on top once yeah. in. In the air, left field, down the line. Cordero makes the grab on the run. Back here at the ballpark. Now it's Aaron Judge up to the plate. The wide to kick the pitch. Ball one, no strikes. Swing and a miss. Well, here's Aaron Judge, a former rookie of the year, an MVP in 2022, and of course, Ziggy, the cover man for MLB The Show in 2018. The next offering misses. It's two and two. Yeah, it's hard to imagine after Derek Jeter, the New York Yankees, having a homegrown player that can be such a face of the franchise. But this guy's not just the face. He takes up the entire cover with his size and stature. To second, but way too late. Safe there. Seeing some good swings from him right now with consecutive extra base hits. When you connect and it jumps off your bat like that, you're thinking double at the very least. Put a great swing on it, and man, he wasn't fooled at all. Fouls went off out of play back to our left. Next offering is in for a strike. Next offering misses. Now one and two. They tried to get him to go, chase the pitch down and away, but he wouldn't bite. The one two. And that's ripped for a base hit. And they get it in quickly. First and third now with nobody out. Up next for the Yankees. Glaber Torres up to the plate. Over one so far. That's in for a strike. A little out front there as he swings through it. And a pitch. Got him looking. That's a strikeout. Two on, one out. Jose Trevino stepping in now for the Yankees. 0 for 1 with a fly out. Now this is a rocket to left. Quan makes the play. Runner tags from third. Runner from third in to score. It's 1-1. That wasn't your standard sack fly. He barreled that baseball, just couldn't get it to drop in. Cordero stands in with two away as he takes a ball. Bounce to the right. They take the force out. That's out number three. Back now at Progressive Field. Bottom of the inning. Stepping up for the Guardians. Josh Naylor. Oh and the first pitch misses for ball one. You know, these Guardians showing great discipline at the plate. And patience That's definitely seems to be the name of their game in this one. He's only given up one run. No but break. the starter's pitch count is starting to get up there. And that might be the best oh, news yet for this offense. 
And the right hander deals. Inside corner, and that's called a strike. You know, sometimes all it takes is getting to the next arm before an offense does any damage, and that might be the case today. On the ground to the left. Throw pulls him off the bag, and he's safe. Stepping in, Oscar Gonzalez. The right field. Oscar Gonzalez. And he swings and misses at the initial offering. And that one is lifted in the air. Cordero under it, one away. So digging in, George Valera. The center fielder. And he swings and misses, and it's nothing at one. And downstairs. No, he's really working him away, this at bat. Sometimes take a little bit off velocity. Try to get a rollover, something on the ground. Stay away from that big hole on the right side of the infield. The pitch. Got him swinging. Now batting. Catcher. Bo Naylor Bo. digs in for the Guardians. He popped out his first time. In there for strike one. Naylor leads off first with two down to the inning. In the dirt, and the runner stays where he is. And one and two. In the air to left, down the line. Reaches for it, but it's foul. Another one, two. Swing and a miss. Chase the fastball up the ladder for strike three. Welcome back. Here's some real power at the plate. Harrison Bader. Harrison Bader. The pitch. And a big swing and a miss. You know, these Yankees looking to string together better at bats when they have runners on, but it just hasn't happened for them yet. They only have one hit with runners in scoring position, so a lot of squandered opportunities. It's tough because those are moments you just can't get back. Nope. Next offering is downstairs. Out towards left center. Racing makes the catch. And there's one down. So up next, Anthony Volpe. First pitch, not close. Good eye right there. Way inside, and that hit him. Now, biggest concern, other than injury, after a moment like that, is just how the pitcher will respond. You know, sometimes a guy lose confidence in a pitch when he's hit somebody. And now it's DJ LeMayhew digging in. Line drive caught. Now up is the Yankees D.H. Oswaldo Cabrera. One for two. McKenzie over to first. Volpe back easily. That one pushed foul. Here comes the 0-1. Now a one and one. So now one and two. Well, he went inside a couple of times, and now outside. Hitter's not exactly sure where to look for this next pitch. Checks his swing. Appeal down to third, and he held back, according to Dave Lawrence. That one is absolutely belted. Valera raging back towards the wall. Back some more. 
And it's caught just in front of the wall. And welcome back. We head to the bottom of the fifth. So in now for Cleveland, Miles Straw. And the first oh, offering is like not close. And that's in for a strike. This game has been so tight. Feels like the next team to score will win it. Going to count one and two. One ball. Wow, no fair two right strikes. there. I mean, that slider didn't move to the very last moment. Incredibly difficult to pick that up. Just kind of have to tip your cap on that pitch. And he deals. Three. Picks up strikeout number seven. So the lineup flips over. Now it's the second baseman, Andres Jimenez. First pitch, and he just misses. Sneaks through, base hit. So a man aboard now with one away. I'm sure he feels really good about that one. I know that was a ground ball, but it was absolutely hammered through the infield. That's not one you're excited to get in front of if you're an infielder. You know they used to say, charge it. Crazy. And now, Stephen Kwan. In there, and it's 0-1. Jimenez, the runner at first with one gone to the inning. Next offering is in for a strike. Well, he didn't like those first two pitches. Now in an 0-2 hole, he's going to have to battle. I hope he gets a mistake. Runner on the goal. No throw, safe at second. Swing and a pop up in foul ground. And there's two down. Well, that was a pitch you got to crush. Unbelievable now that he missed it right there. I'm telling you, he is going to be frustrated with himself until his next at bat. Ramirez at the plate now. And that's inside. And fouled off. As a pitcher, you know the runner on second is ready to push things with his speed. A base hit is probably going to be a big run, so you really have to execute on the mound. Great effort as he's able to haul it in. And that is that. Back here at the ballpark, top six. It's Aaron Judge now. The right-hander back to work. Judge, 30 years old now. Can't forget to mention he's a former MVP. Swing and a miss, strike one. It really looks like these hitters have been in between with their timing today. Good fastball, excellent slider but they've not been able to commit to one velocity and stay there. Oh. Toss to Naylor, and that's one out as they get the leadoff hitter in the sixth. Now I always remember watching Johan Santana pitch, and when he was in his prime, you would see a lot of guys out in front, right-handers pulling that change up in the stands and then fouling the fastball the opposite field up into the stands. The 0-1. And a base hit. So they get a man aboard with a one-out single. Nice line drive to the pull side right there, but he didn't spin off of it. That's the key. You still have to extend through the baseball in order to hit a line drive like that. Here is Glaber Torres. And a pitch. This one popped up. Foul ground first base side. Makes the grab for the second out. Digging in, Jose Trevino. First offering, misses the...
Mark Trevino goes five feet 11 inches 210 pounds and they went out and made a trade for him last season. And a 1 1. And a foul ball. Rizzo, the runner at first with two gone. And now the count is even. The only adjustment he needs to make is his target. If you aim at the outside corner, that slider's going to end up way off the plate. Perhaps look a little more down the middle, and you get it right where you want it. At the belt and fires. Got him. So he's gotten. Cole back to work. Bell in the box again. Takes a strike. Ball one there. I got one ball, one strike. And a pop-up, right side, foul territory. The one-two. Got him looking. He's got to be frustrated with that call. And now it's Josh Naylor. Here's the strike. Boog, that hook's looking pretty sharp today. Oh, Just a solid pitching performance so far, and I really yeah. think it's because of that curveball. Got it by him for the K. Oscar Gonzalez digs in for the Guardians. Aye. And that's in there for strike one. And that's a base hit. So a two out knock keeps the inning alive. George Valera digs in for the Guardians. Here's a new pitcher from the pen, number 97. He last pitched two days ago. First pitch, and that's in for a strike. And that's through there for a strike. And at bat like this is almost over as it begins. In this situation, you have no idea what the next pitch is going to be. You just got to hope that you can make contact. The 0-2. Now he breaks his bat. LeMayhew on the run, throw to first. Safe at first as they can't make the play. Bo Naylor digs in for the Guardians. There's a strike. Well, we call that key holding. Even though it's right there and looks pretty good, if he doesn't love it, he's not going to swing that early in the count. Ball to strike. That one missed. Could be some action here on this next pitch. Couple runners on. Probably a challenge pitch coming. Sharp grounder. That's through for a base hit. Coming home. Here comes the throw. Not in time. He's safe at the plate. They take the lead. It's 2-1.
Showed some really nice patience in that at bat. Worked himself into a good count. Got the top of the ball a little bit, but not much. That was hit pretty hard. Ah, and this ball gets down. It's a hit. Runner from second crosses the plate, and they take a two-run lead. First pitch swing in, went up there with a the plan to be aggressive. Everything was on time and fluid in that swing. Got a pitch he could get the barrel on and lined it into center for the knock. Those always feel good. Here's Andres Jimenez. Pitch is in there, and that's strike one. Breaking ball through there for a strike. Two outs, a couple of base runners at first and second. Swing and a miss, struck him out. The high heat, too much on that one. Back here in Cleveland, top of inning number seven, and here is Franchi Cordero. And a pitch. And there's a ball. Well, after scoring runs, this is where you're looking for that shutdown inning. Get that hot team back in there to swing the bats. In the air, out towards right center. Valera after it. Makes a nice grab at a full sprint. One down. The Yankees looking to rally. Here's the center fielder, Harrison Bader. First offering, and it just misses. And a pop-up, right side, foul territory. And he can't quite get there. It's a foul ball. So, a foul ball makes it one and two. And that misses oh, off the outside edge. Goes down, swinging for the strikeout. Some high cheese for strike three. And the batter will be the shortstop, Anthony Volpe. Bounce to the right side. Jimenez throw to first. And that's the third out. Here in Cleveland, set for the last half of the seventh, and now Stephen Kwan. The pitch and ball one. And a foul ball. Next offering is foul back. Righty to the plate. Fouls it off, still one and two. Left hand batter waits. Oh, that's okay. Just missed. And a swing and a miss. And he's down on strikes for the now second back. time today. Here's Jose Ramirez. First pitch, just misses. And there's a breaking ball that drops in there. And there's a strike of the outside corner. And that is strike two. Cuts and misses. It's a strikeout. Now Here's Josh Bell. And that one fouled off. Right-handed reliever. And that one fouled off. And a swing and a miss. Down on strikes. That is the inning. Welcome back. And a new arm on the mound to start the eighth. Sam Hentges. These are the spots where relievers really make a name for themselves. Late and close. There's not much margin for error, but at the same time, there's a reason they're put in these situations. Catcher tosses the mask, settles under it. He's got it. One up, one down. 
That was a good hard fastball with some nice ride up in the zone right there. Hitter looked like he was on it, but I think that velocity at the end just the beat ball. him. Instead of a line drive or something hit deep, it's a pop up and an easy out for the defense. Swings through that one. It's been tough for the offense so far, but you can't get frustrated. You got to find a way to shake it off, go up there and relax. That's the only way you're going to be able to put runs up on the board. The wind of the pitch. That's in there. And the count is even two and two. The punch out there. Two down. Here is Aaron Judge. Swings through that one. 0 oh, and 1. Well, as good as things can be, it can be a tough day at the office, even for the skippers. Seeing the offense just sputter, not able to get anything going. There comes an 0-2 to Judge. Swing and a miss, and he struck him out. Third out, and that ends the frame. New pitcher for the Yankees, Jonathan Loisica. Just trying to keep this one close here, and this is where a bullpen can give their guys a chance to fight back into the game. And here's the first baseman, Josh Naylor. Slings it across. One gone to the bottom of the eighth. So digging in, Oscar Gonzalez. And that one just misses a ball and no strikes. Up the middle. Throw off line. He's safe. And a nice job there to keep it from getting away. So up next, George Valera. Swing and a miss. And that is strike one. There's a strike. Oh, two is the count. Gonzalez leads off first with one away. Foul ball. It stays nothing in two. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. Pulled the string of the changeup. Now the catcher up to hit. Bo Naylor. First pitch doesn't find the zone. one and Next offering is foul back. The 1-1. One, one. And that two. skips in the dirt. Two, one. Swings and pulls it foul to the right side. And a swing and a miss. And that's that. We're back. It's the top of the ninth. And there's a new pitcher on the mound, Eli Morgan. This is his fifth appearance of the year. The pitch. Rizzo, the next to hit, takes outside. Right-hander kicks, deals. Swing and a miss. And a count one and two. In the dirt. And they get the leadoff man in the ninth. Well, maybe approaching this at bat with a bit too much determination. Sometimes you just got to let the game come to you. Torres now at the plate as he swings through strike one. This guy's seen two changeups in a row. Could be a little vulnerable for a fastball right here. 
on the ground. Toss to Naylor. And Glaber Torres retired. Two outs, bases empty. Jose Trevino will hit next. And he swings and misses at the initial offering. Morgan, 26 years old, and he was drafted in the eighth round back in 2017. Next pitch is popped up. And that'll do it. The Guardians take the first two games of this series. The ball for his first career save deserves to be on display at his house. I mean, it's kind of like when a restaurant frames its first dollar bill somewhere on a wall. You just can't forget your first save. And your final 3-1 for Chris Singleton and our entire crew. I'm John Chomby saying so long.